stress. I have an idea for something fun. Fun? What exactly does an MI6 agent think is fun? You don't know? Well then, this will be educational. Educational, huh? You know me so well. Good fight. Working for the Syndicate was a great job. That is, until Philippe Loren died, because Kilbane was one scary psychopath. I mean, I watched him kill Kiki right in front of me, and right in front of her own sister. So I went after the Saints instead. Wrong choice on my part. But they let me live, and surprisingly, so did Kilbane. The only option then was to leave the country and hide. I should have known dating that asshole was gonna end badly. Veteran child. What kind of name is that anyway? Sure, for some of the best drugs in Stillwater, but that's no excuse. And he comes and tries to kill me? Whatever. He didn't have a chance against the boss. I tried to warn him, but he never listened to me. Only the boss really did. to experience the life of a secret service agent. A VIP is in town and it's our responsibility to see she safely arrives at all three stops on her route. Along the way, we'll encounter scenarios typical of a VIP escort job. So, are you ready to put your life on the line to protect another? Asha, I'm pretty much a superhero. I'm set for whatever you can throw at me. You'll find Matt has disabled your special abilities for the duration of this exercise, but don't worry. You'll get them back once the exercise is complete. Get in. You're driving the VIP to her first stop. So who's a mark? You're on the client's time now. You do whatever needs to be done. Was it too much for you? The police fire. All right, this is bugging me. I know that woman. Who is she? Are you serious? That's Tammy Tolliver, the reporter from Genki Bowl. Couldn't find any diplomats in town or something? A security work is a cereal box. You don't get to pick your prize. Hey, see that guy over there? Tell me. Is he a threat? I don't know. It's your job to know. You have to decide right now. Take him out and possibly kill an innocent human being, or let him go and potentially put your VIP in mortal danger. Good job. Security might just be your plan B. All right, back in the car.
Intel reports high threat probability at our next stop, so we should be prepared for anything. Right, absolutely. Potential threats all over the place. Oh, I'm glad to see you taking this so seriously. Is MI6 really called upon to escort TV correspondents on shopping trips? Prior to MI6, I babysat overprivileged children of foreign dignitaries on multiple occasions. And after a certain street gang... That's Newstime's Street Gang of the Year, thank you very much. You'll need a vantage point. Get to that rooftop across the way over there. Cover the VIP as I escort her into the building. This makes getting to work faster. Pretending to shoot stuff. You're easily bored, aren't you? Oh no. I'm usually too busy being awesome to be bored. We're coming out now. Everything clear? Blue skies and hummingbirds. Come on out. Snipers! Shit! You said we were clear! I thought we were! They couldn't fight worse shit. Why exactly would people be targeting Tammy Tolliver? She's still someone's prized cat toy or something? We don't know. You might be surprised to learn how little information agents are actually given. Usually just a name and an objective. And what's your motivation for doing it? Queen and country, the greater good, duty and honor. And one too many action movies as a kid? Oh, no such thing. Get to the car! Now we're leaving! I wish my radio would quit acting. So, are we enjoying ourselves then? You sure know how to show a girl a good time. But we need to get Tammy somewhere safe. We're almost done. Just one more stop. anything to me. Keep sharp. We may have a situation. Oh, shit! This part of your plan? Say it is. I'll guard the VIP. You get to cover. Well, you are really going all out with this. Matt, feel free to dial things down a bit. Matt? Matt! Oh, is he not answering? Shame. I must have accidentally cut him off. Zinyak, you fucking... Ugh. Always with the vulgarity. Anywho... Have some fun with these <laughs> minor changes I made. I love action. Hold on! I'm calling in a rescue vehicle! You can do that without Matt? I wouldn't put us in harm's way without some backup protocol, you know? All right, sit tight. The car should be here shortly. Cover me while I get some more. Ah, shit! <sighs> A little help, please. Oh, thanks. <sighs> Just hang on. Here comes a rescue vehicle now. I'll be right back. I'm going to get the car. Well, fuck. You both sit tight. 
I'll be back for you. I'm always on when it counts. So everything according to plan, huh? Was life without a few curveballs, you know? After this gets jacked, no more. This isn't a rental. Okay, we're here. What now? Is this over? As soon as the VIP's helo arrives, she's still in our charge until then. Um, is that how it's being delivered? I don't think so. I knew Genki couldn't be too far behind. He just blew up Tammy! What is Zinyak's fascination with Genki? Why don't the two of them just make a baby already? Do not put that image in my head! What the hell is he doing? Holy shit! Did he just turn into some kind of super Genki? It appears so. Damn it! There's no way we can take him. I could if I had my superpowers. Oh. Huh. Right. Well. Hello. Hello. Can you hear me? Glad you can make it back. You can give me my superpowers now. Oh, I don't think so. I'm not falling for your tricks. Matt, give the powers back. Oh, I see. Okay. What on earth happened while we were disconnected? Explain later. Powers. Now. <laughs> This is... Wow! Not bad, huh? Let's kick some Genki ass! That's over. Not bad. You can really handle yourself. <laughs> when it comes to ganking Genki, I'm your girl. 